Hi, I'm Tim Van Milligan. Today I'd like to talk to you about the tube marking guide set from Estes. Uh, we've now started selling this. Uh, this product is really good for people that are designing their own rockets because it allows you to build a little bit faster. Uh, the best part of the guide are these things here. Um, these are to mark the number of the fin locations on your rocket. Um, if you don't have those, um, in the past what you would use is a paper one like this or the cutout one like this where you cut it out and wrap it around the rocket and then mark off the, the proper fin locations. Um, when using this, what you would do is you'd put it on the paper like that, align it to the right ring and then kind of hold it and like you can tell I'm pretty unsteady here. And the, the longer the tube, the harder this is to hold. And then you would put a little tick mark here on the bottom of the tube. Um, these things are a lot easier to use because basically you just slide it on and it holds it for you. And then you just align it to the right number of fins. And you can mark either three or four fins with these. So you align it right here, make, make the mark, spin it around. If I was doing three fins, I would do this line right here. And then finally, I would do this one right here. And that would give me uh, tick marks for the three fins. And these are set up for uh, different size tubes. So like this one here was the, the 18 millimeter tube. If you want to use a 50 millimeter, um, a VT50 size tube, you'd use this one here. Um, the only thing that is a kind of a mistake in these is they don't have a VT70 tube for um, these size plastic rings um, so that you're, you will have to use this one here. And if you want this one here, it's in the book Model Rocket Design and Construction and you can get that from us here at Apogee Components. Uh, the other component of this tube marking guide set is this part here. And this has a number of uses. Um, the first one is to draw lines down the side of the tube. So now that I have the little tick mark here, now I need to extend the line up so I can attach a fin. And to do that, you move this slider all the way out of the way. Um, and then you'll find the right size body tube here. And this is a BT20. And I'll run my pencil line. So first I'll find that little tick mark, which is right down here. And then I'll just take the pencil and holding it in there, I can just draw it up along the tube and I got a nice straight line. Um, ideally, I, um, this, this little slot should go a little bit longer. Um, it doesn't, but you can um, just reposition and then continue drawing the line up the tube if you need a longer line. Uh, the other thing that you can use this for is to draw lines around the tube. Say I needed a, a line right here for the front edge of the fin. Um, so what I would do, you stick a pencil in this little hole here and it comes out the other side. And I'll stick that on my tick mark here and slide this here like that. And then putting pressure on the pencil just draw a line around the outside of the tube, like that. Uh, and finally, what this can be used for is it has this little holder on the side, and that's good for holding fins. So what you would do, you would take a rubber band, put it around the tube like that, um, find your line that you just drew, and then the fin in it like that and it holds it nicely. Um, that makes sure that your fin is straight along the tube and then you can just leave it in this position while the glue dries and then take it off and then move it around to the next fin so you can get all your fins on there. So this is a, a nice little set. Um, it's been around since the early 90s uh, when I used to work at Estes. I helped one of the developers create this little tool so I, I still like it. Um, so I, I still recommend it, and that's why we're selling it here at Apogee Components. If you'd like to know more about building rockets, uh, check out our videos. They're under the download link on our website. 
Um, my name again is Tim Van Milligan and this is the Apogee Rocketry Workshop.